by Taiwan KK Corporation. These mannequin tests were performed by BTTG, British Textile Technology Group, in 2009. These two firefighting suits are both certified with the European standard EN469, which is widely used all over the world for protective clothing for structural firefighters. The third generation of the Ralph male mannequin has a total of 135 sensors distributed over the head, torso, legs, arms, and hands, which monitor the temperature on the surface of the mannequin during the test. The fully dressed mannequins are tested with a gas flame engulfment apparatus consisting of 12 burners, which produces a mean heat flux level of 84 kilowatts per square meter. The temperature goes above 800 degrees Celsius and the flame exposure time is 8 seconds. After the severe testing conditions, both garments are carbonized. The navy blue Nomex garment turns yellowish brown. Let's look at the results obtained from the sensors. The gray area is the no damage part before the test. Here comes the results after 30 seconds. The yellow area indicates first degree burn, the orange is for second degree burns, and the red is third degree burns. Please compare the numbers. After 60 seconds, the burned area gets larger. You can see the injury becomes more and more severe at 90 seconds. After 120 seconds, we can see the final result. Look at the accumulated injured area of first, second, and third degree burns. The numbers for the Canux garment are all way below those for the Nomex. The total burn percentage for the Canux garment is 58%, while the Nomex is 71%. The gray colored no damage area on the Canox is much bigger than that on the Nomex. Let's watch it again. The third degree burn appears on the Nomex garment at 24 seconds. Afterwards, the third degree burn area increases dramatically as the protection breaks down. At 30 seconds, the mannequin wearing the Nomex garment suffers from severe pain on almost half of the whole body. The first 30 seconds is the golden time determining whether a fireman can evacuate safely from an unexpected disaster. Would you be able to get out of a fire bearing such huge pain? The third degree burn appears on the Canox mannequin at 47 seconds. Compare the third degree burn timing. The Canox strives to give firefighters almost double the safety time. During firefighting, every second counts because it's a matter of life or death. Here comes the result of second plus third degree burn tests. Canox, 28.1%. Nomex, 44.7%. This is the comparison of the total burn area. Canox, 57.9%. Nomex, 71%. You protect people who protect you. Canox is a breakthrough fire-resistant fabric in the high-tech textile industry. It's blended of top flame resistant and superior high strength fiber, rendering the best performance for protective clothing. Canox, a revolutionary fabric in the fire industry, providing the highest level of comfort, protection and reliability in the world.
Two firemen wearing Canox firefighting suits enter a wooden house with an oil fire inside. It is 800 to 1000 degrees Celsius or above the ambient temperature. The conditions are quite similar to those during the mannequin test. Before entering, one fireman destroys the window according to the SOP. Now they are ready to enter. Watch the flame inside the door. There is no hose line support during this operation. The following is the video made at the scene. These two firemen stayed inside the cabin around seven seconds. They withdrew with smoke all over the body. Let's see it again. See the fire inside the door? There is still no hose line support at this time. The water hose finally arrives. These two firemen continue their operation. The cabin is totally engulfed in fire. Let me remind you again that this drill was done at 800 to 1000 degrees Celsius for seven seconds. Under similar conditions as the mannequin test, 800 degrees Celsius for eight seconds. The outer shell was carbonized due to direct flame burn. The moisture barrier is discolored by black smoke, but not damaged. The wall insulation remains intact. Obviously, the thermal felt functioned well to insulate and provide high fire resistance performance. The Canax firefighting suit kept the firemen safe under challenging, dangerous conditions. These two firefighters do not have any burn injuries after this extremely dangerous operation. Look at their smiley faces. They're pretty lucky to be wearing Canox fire suits.